at this workshop in Walthamstow, they know that manufacturing furniture means making mountains of sawdust. Sweeping it up might seem like an obvious solution, but perhaps not for much longer. Safety inspectors have told Michael, who owns the business, that using a broom is a health hazard. This is nonsense. It is fiddling around trying to find something to do, and it's a bit bossy, frankly. So this is dated the 5th of June. Michael got a letter from the health and safety executive. It said they were worried that his employees were being exposed to airborne wood dust. It told him to consider banning brooms and buy specialised vacuums instead. Michael says that would cost him thousands of pounds and wouldn't be as effective. The waste you get on a factory floor is mixed waste. It's not all uniform. You get offcuts, chips, sawdust, shavings. That blocks a vacuum cleaner really quickly. And what do we do when a vacuum cleaner hose is blocked? Well, I don't know. Most people give it a bang. And what happens then? Dust. Work-related lung disease causes 12,000 deaths every year. This video from the health and safety executive demonstrates the dangers of dry sweeping. But Michael says used properly, a broom should minimise the damage. Don't lift the broom off the ground, push. The key is short, soft bristles. Uh, okay. And if it's a nice wide broom, then it's more efficient. But the inspectors aren't convinced. They say, while it's simply not the case that HSE has banned the use of broomsticks, companies are being encouraged to use one of the many safer and more efficient types of equipment where the health of workers is better protected. Inspectors will be back here next month, but Michael says he won't budge on the broom, which is part of the furniture. Chloe Keady, ITV News, Walthamstow.